Greetings and salutations, folks. My name is Nick, and welcome back to Call of Duty Vanguard, where we are once again jumping back into the past, following Lucas, uh, the demolitions expert. I presume I, I was presuming that he this his story is taking place in the the North African campaign, but I suppose all I have to do is look up the word Tobruk. Um, that is a port city in Libya's eastern Mediterranean coast, near the border with, with Egypt. Okay, so yeah, there we go. Um, how this relates to the rest of the story, if does that relate to the rest of the story, or is this just kind of like another mini-episode of like, meet this character, find out why he fights. And there, there seems to be a lot of that. Like, meet Kingsley and Webb find out why they fight. Uh, meet Polina, find out why she fights. Meet this guy, Wade. But let us go right to the checkpoint. Because I believe we left off with a card game. Today, princess. I'm savoring the moment. And also, why do I have so many cards? What, what kind of game are we playing? Wake up, you're gonna want to see this one. Oh, are we playing Uno with cards. with regular cards? Can you play Uno with regular cards? Read them and wait. Oh, you fucking donkey! No way! Why the bloody hell aren't you at your post? Uh, Major Hems, we thought, we thought you'd muck around. Major, convoy's approaching. Right. You rats, follow me. I'll try and act like real soldiers for once. Sir. Yes, sir. No, sir. Three. See, that's what a real soldier looks like, eh? <laughs> ah, what a way to stand up to him, Bluey. That's a job, buddy. Fuck off, Des. What's he even doing here in the first place, huh? He's a major. He can do whatever he wants. An Owen gun. Fancy. I must say, this game does a good job at really kind of varying up the weaponry, even though most of the weapons are basically just variations of... Assault rifle and submachine gun. With a giant clip that takes up like half the screen. The explosives are ready. Of course. Set them ourselves. Sir. Man your position. I am. The timing must be perfect. I need you all to focus. Got eyes on them. Quiet over there. Hang on now. What's that in the lead? I said, be quiet. Ah, ah, ah. I'll do the honors. Thank you. Yep. Sir. Mark is that first rock. Yes, I know. That's a tank. Well, the Germans have tanks, Private. Sir, but the armor's too thick. We didn't pack for a tank. Bloody hell. Hit the treads. It's the only way you're going to stop it. I, I, I need to focus. No, 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 sir. Wait for the treads. No, no, wait! <laughs> With orders. We distracted you with orders. Lucas. Can I? Oh. Nice. If only my gun was as accurate as my throwing hand. Oh, everybody charge. Although I suppose it makes sense that the explosives expert has the, um, the throwing arc. Hold on. Ah. Well, 
All right, let's run forward a little bit. Shoot. Yeah, this gun takes up a lot of real estate on the screen. Especially in the area where you're actually supposed to be aiming. See that? That's a much cleaner appearance. I mean, I don't have any bullets for it, but hey. But that's fine. I should be able to find bullets elsewhere. Ooh, what are you? Lucas, search that one on the edge. All right, I'll see what I can do. Are you dead? Oh, is this going to force a cutscene? This is probably going to force a cutscene. I can see it. I'll be attacked by something. Yep, there we go. Sir, there's still one truck down the ridge. Well, then take some rest and get after them, Jacobs. Let's go. No good for sniffing around the dirt. All right. And when you're done, walk your ass back to the camp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks for the um. Thanks for the the good fortune. On such a nice night. On such a nice moonlit night. We can fix that. Are you uh German? Good night, Kraut. Thought there were more. He can carry up to four different types? Wow. Then we find it. Fancy. Do I want a... I haven't even shot this gun. We're wasting time. Let's go. Yeah, that's more rifle than you can handle. Bigger the better, mate. <laughs> Fresh blood. Follow it. Fucking genius idea, Jacobs. That's sir to you, private. The name's Des. And that's Lucas. And neither of us give a fuck about your rank. We all know about you, Jacobs. Us rats pay attention more than you think. What do we know about Jacobs? Other than the fact that neither of them can walk around a rock. Is he running towards reinforcements? He's probably running towards reinforcements. Who's he shouting to? This way. Bloody hell. Oi, this ain't on our maps. Down, we aren't equipped for this. We can take him. Are you yeah. mad? All right, should I take the first shot? Keep down. Don't let them see you. Lucas, look up for they're falling back. back. Ah, there we go. Damn, they shot up the there we go. Unfortunately, I only have six bullets.
So I will hopefully make them count. Or I'll just use this pistol. Oh, there's a, a fire truck right there. And throw another one. And then, oh. Okay. I think I got a bunch of them. Hello. Also, this pistol seemed a little bit more dangerous than I was expecting. Ooh, throwing knives. And I have the ability to see a throwing arc, so that's even better. Hey, I found something. You read Kraut? A little. Of course he does. It looks like one of Rommel's officers checked through here to visit a camp up the way. I don't know what kind, I don't recognize these symbols. Then we go take a look. The Krauts just lit up the sky, more could be coming. No, we return to base. Report to the Major. We can't report a thing if we don't know what it is. That wouldn't be good soldiering, Jacobs. Fine. We'll scope it out. Let's tread quietly this time. All right. Luckily, this thing has a silencer and ammo. This road should take us directly to the camp. Yeah, straight into those crowds. Uh, I don't think this silencer is going to help me against that tank. I told you they saw the flare. That glow on the horizon it must be the German camp. I say we stay off the road. We'll cut through the desert. Yeah, that's probably a decent idea. I'll try to hold back. But I do have a silencer on my gun. So. Huh. So don't mind me. I wonder how how well these guys can actually see you. All right. I could probably take this guy down via a quick takedown of some sort. Like, where ahead? Oh, yep, never mind. That was a sudden lunge forward. Ah, yep, there goes the hornet's nest. That's okay. We can run for it. This this is just fine. Also, I feel like whoever made this level has seen 1917.
Oh, hello. Yep, nope, we're still good. We're still golden. We're doing some good soldiering out here. Oh my gosh. I have no choice. This controller is... Not only is it making me walk really slowly, but... It is now preventing me from going forward. I need a drink. Talk with your man, Hans. He's got plenty. What? He's never shared a sip from his fancy flask? Well, there should be plenty to go around. He's a bloody lightweight. If I ever get my hands on that wanker's flask, mm -hmm. it's my yeah. shout, fellas. Hang on. There's a line up ahead. Luckily, I don't have to <laughs> walk sideways to sneak through here. I just take. I just end up being slowed down by deaths here. And look, is the most important tent the first one? That's all. That would be convenient. For us, I reckon. Hold on, what's all this? Who cares? Press the button that says examine map. You just shove the map aside and grab the thing below it. And the chap on the right is important. Who's the fancy bugger? Seriously? We're gathering intelligence. Something you obviously lack, Private. Hilarious. You sort your papers. You know what I see? I see a ton of shit outside that goes boom. Now what do you suppose we should do about that? Uh, well, we should blow it the fuck up. <laughs> That's what I call target rich. Motor pool on the left. Ammo dump just ahead. Gas depot on the right. Just ask it to be lit up. Hmm. So what order do we do this in? This is nice. This kind of reminds me of a uh, battlefield... Oh. of Battlefield 1 where um, is the okay nope I just needed to cool down a little bit You guys but yeah where you're given like multiple objectives and you just kind of have to choose how you move around to accomplish them was it battlefield one or was it the other uh world war uh game that they made with battlefield Ah, no, I'm trapped. There's no escape. All right, and then let's throw one on this guy. Excellent. And now we can go to Yeah, that guard tower is not doing anything. Just got the fuel dump and armory to go. Trucks inbound. I'm going to blow it from the inside. That's probably the best way to go. Somebody shooting me to the left. It's got a terrible sh fire rate. But it seems to be like the 
for some reason this pistol seems to be one shot, one kill. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Definitely get the hell out of here. <laughs> clear out, clear out. Get inside and blow up that fuel dump. All right. How do I get inside here? Oh, yep, right through here. Just like the other one. I can manage that. Ah. A slow fire rate combined with terrible aim. Should I use some throwing knives? Let's use some throwing knives. Against nobody. Where did you guys go? I wasn't done shooting at you with guns and stuff. <laughs> nice. All right, let's grab that. Throw this and not die. Not dying being very key there. That was pretty good. You definitely ruined their day. Wait. You guys hear that? That's a play. Ah. Okay, how are we going to deal with this? Can we shoot that thing out of the sky? Okay. Let's... That donkey now while he's still searching for us. I'm gonna see if I can hop onto this turret. Even though he's just behind me right now. He's coming in for another pass! Light him up! Oh, are these? Yeah, these are the time charges. Nope, those aren't even the charges. Those are the knives. Yeah, the throwing knives are probably not going to help me in this scenario. Let's get rid of this other throwing knife. That way I don't accidentally throw it at, like, a car or train or plane. Alright, plane. I wonder if the game expects you to shoot it like a whole bunch of times. Here he comes. Or just like enough times. Hold on. Let's switch to this thing. More crowds driving up the air 
trip. Shoot that fucking sky wanker. Ah, explosives. Let him have it. Where? Up, oh, right over there. Okay, I definitely have to hit him enough times. What about a silenced? Uh... Okay, where I did? He's coming round again. I see him now. Damn it. <laughs> That's what I get for shooting at him out of the open. Instead of taking my usual turret track. I don't necessarily, like, you don't get to see the... Like, the heat or ammo consumption. So it's unclear why the, your, their turret just stops functioning. But I suppose I probably should just stick with the turret at this point. Like right now it just can't shoot. Okay, for like a couple seconds. It runs out of stamina. Well, luckily I have this turret. Here he comes. Enemy infantry. Should I be worried about him or the enemy infantry? Don't worry, I will try to shoot Luke Skywanker out of the sky. Once I've dealt with the other these other reinforcements. Um, he's a little bit far and high. I was gonna say, who's throwing grenades at us? I see it. It's coming round again. That's good because now I got a better, a better shot. And then he blew up another base? On the coast of Italian Lake, All right. an Australian private and a group of rats had given Rommel a huge black eye. Their actions should have earned them medals and maybe even a shred of respect. Pams didn't see it that way. Their reward was some time in the brig. However, all Richter seemed to care about was Rommel and his connection to Freisinger. That fool would listen to Lucas as long as we needed him to. What was his connection to... to Freisingberg? Uh, all I knew is that they had a picture taken together. I caught tunnels. What was the rest? We have very little time. Tell me, what did Freisinger want with Rommel? I thought you wanted to know about our team. 
Answer me now, or our deal is off. Okay, okay. Don't get your undies in a twist. Lucas piled it on like a champ. He didn't have to tell Richter anything more than the lies that Nazi already told himself. That was the Third Reich for you. Their reality was delusion. You'd think we'd need a miracle for Lucas to pull this off. The thing is, he was like a magnet for that kind of luck. There's that saying about lightning striking twice. Yet Lucas had managed to find himself first at Tobruk and then at El Alamein. The world knew of an Allied victory in North Africa. But it wasn't because of British commanders or mighty tanks. Lucas had the untold story. And Richter was eating it up. Oh, so the first story wasn't really related to the plot. It was just character building? Either way... We'll go to Alamin. Al... Alamin later. For now, though, got any suggestions for Sunday Play next? Leave them down in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have yourselves a good night.